coming in tonight, I had a tete a tete with God. And I said to him, when we lift up a worship to him, we will add Ghana to that. When we lift up a worship to God, we will lift Ghana to him as well. That in this election year, that his peace will prevail. Semin kutu kutu. You have your hand, you wave it to God. General Secretary of Ghana, Church of Pentecost, to pray. I just want the house to do the song. You are the humbly. I believe you can stand, please rise to your feet. And I want to, in a moment of one or two minutes, begin to speak to God about Ghana. Talk to God about Ghana. Lift up your voice in prayer. Lindo lo lo raba se kabaya da raba se kabaya Mado raba te And so our Lord We lift up our hands before you tonight And we bring Ghana before you, O God Visit Ghana tonight 
Father, visit Ghana tonight. We pray in the name of Jesus. Look favorably unto Ghana. Look unto Ghana with mercy, O oh God, with grace, O oh God, with favor, O oh God, in the name of Jesus. And as we go into elections, O oh God, we pray that give us a leader, give us a president in the name of Jesus. And let this election be peaceful. We pray for peaceful election. We are praying in the name of Jesus against any violence, against any violence, against any violence. Let there be peace in the name of Jesus. At the end of the day, Ghana will win. Ghana will win. Ghana will not be defeated. Ghana will be victorious. In the name of Jesus, let there be peace in Jesus' name. We pray for all that matter. So far as these elections are concerned, the Electoral Commission, we pray for the politicians, we pray for the security services, grant them, oh God, wisdom, grant them strength, grant them grace, oh God. And as our politicians travel from the north to the south, from the east to the west, we pray for protection for them. We declare Ghana will win. We declare Ghana will win. And your name alone will be blessed. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Gentlemen, put your hands together for Jesus.